tutorial.com today now i will discuss over the ratch retransmission p ratch retransmission uh, i will discuss the ratch process in different tutorial and today we will discuss over the issue of p ratch retransmission which means you send p ratch and network send the ratch response at different trial so some question is arises here uh, like that uh, what if ue does not receive the ratch response at first trial oh, second is what is ue supposed to do in this case answer is simple just retry the p ratch in this case you might have any back of indicator value which normally transmitted in maxi command control element being sent with the rar that means uh, if ue does not receive the ratch response from the network then it will retry the p ratch so there is another case where you need to retry the p ratch it is the case where you receive rar from the network but the rapid is not for it R rapid is not for it that means uh, when you will see here uh, p ratch is sent here and the preamble index you will select the any randomly will select the any preamble index and it will send in rar there is a rapid same preamble index will fill in the rapid and it's sent to the ue what happens in this case ue received the rar uh, grant from the network but rapid is not available here uh, rapid is available but in that case if rapid is not available that means we will assume that uh, this is for the back of indicator and uh, <coughs> if rar is in this case it is highly probable that back of indicator value is transmitted with rar to control the p ratch retransmission timing so rapid is not available then uh, rar uh, that rar, rar is for the back of indicator and through the back of indicator we will know that when u will retransmit the p ratch so here you will see here this is a back of indicator header of the mac and uh, through the back of indicator of value is index value of back of indicator 0 to 250 so 0 is for the 0 so millisecond 1 is for 10 millisecond 20 millisecond according to this index value uh, <coughs> network will inform the ue when ue will retransmit the p ratch uh, uh, so here question is arises when do i have to retry that means what should be the time delay between the previous transmission and next transmission so answer is simple that uh, uh, it will, if rapid is not available available in rar that it uh, most probably it will for the back of indicator and uh, this uh, and, and according to the back of indicator value we will know that uh, the timing of uh, retransmission of the p ratch from here uh, that means key, uh, it is defined by 3 gpp so according to that we will uh, you will decide that which, when uh, you will retransmit the p ratch Second question is, do I have to retransmit the p ratch with the same power as a previous one? Yeah, try with the little bit higher power. If I have to try with the little bit higher power, how much power do I have to increase? Uh, so, in size, it's also provided by the network in shift do information. That power ramping step is a answer. Power step, a power ramping step equal to db2 that means ue has to increase p ratch power by 2 db every time it retry so we'll see here in sib2 information sib2 there is one element is power ramping a step db2 db2 that means it will increase the 2 db every time during the retry third question if i keep failing third question if i keep failing the receive ratch response how many time i have to retry do you have to retry until the battery run out yeah retry only the several time and give up if i have to give up after a certain amount of try exactly how many time i do do i have to retry so answer is uh, uh preamble transmission maximum it's also coming sib2 information and uh, <coughs> Uh, if a uh, preamble transmission maximum equal to n6 it means you retry p ratch transmission only six times and then give up so here you will see preamble transmission maximum is n6 it will retry for the six times then it will give up so these are the <coughs> uh, 
some query regarding when you will uh, when you will try to know that p ratch retransmission re process so these things will come in your mind these things will be you will see in the uh, any uh, in network issues so now i will see the logs what have, how it look like in uh, in logs uh, in ue logs e have seen cell 9384 and uh, when you will see air in air messages it like like uh, rsc connection reestablishment request cause other failure is other failure so here rlf is happened rlf is happened due to the preamble transmission maximum preamble transmission maximum uh, uh, preamble transmission maximum that means uh, sr service reached maximum number of transmissions and filled sr service reached maximum number of retransmission that means ki uh, uh, pH transmission is reached to the maximum level after that getting the fill rlf is happened due to rf failure is so what happened here initially ue was in afcn 9384 according to log before that it was assuming that rlf is happened before that it was in another cell log is not captured properly uh, so uh, according to that log 98 uh, ue was uh, trying to uh, uh, latch in 9384 one cell is available that time and it's trying to send the random access latch process uh, it sent try to setting the preamble information but it is back off is happening so we'll see here uh it's try to send uh, initiate the preamble information but uh, after that back office trigger again back office trigger so according to that uh, we have discussed about n6 uh, preamble transmission maximum is n6 n6 this preamble transmission n6 so we'll see in log uh, n6 is happening or not uh, first back off I started here uh, try to retry the uh, send the pre uh, preamble information so first time it back off second third four fifth and sixth after that again initiate preamble information so first uh, initially it was started here it sent preamble after that it retry six times and then uh, finished and uh, failed to send the preamble information then again here initiate another uh, initiate here so after six time uh, first to after six time a stop preamble transmission finished because it reached a maximum times so it uh, it uh, stopped the transmission finished and uh, and after rf finished it again re initiate the preamble transmission so again it will send six times and get uh, uh, transmission uh, transmission is a maximum preamble transmission is a maximum sr transmission is a maximum and get a field so uh, this is the uh, issues log where we have seen this type of the issue and uh, reestablishment uh, uh, later uh, we see the rlf is happened and uh, this is the issue today of uh, uh, preamble retransmission so next time we'll come with the new issue in next video so please subscribe my video for the new videos thank you